Hi gamers, welcome back. This is Bharat. I hope you are enjoying all these gameplays with the minimalistic commentary. Let's dive into the gameplay. But before that, don't forget to subscribe the channel. Did you see anything strange on the night of the attack? Hmm. Come to think of it, I noticed one of the longships wasn't where it usually is. It was beached further north, on the riverbank. Where was this? Northeast of here, along the shore. It's been a few days, though. May not be there now. <laughs> Did anything strange happen before the attack on Grandridge? I saw two Saxons riding past the city while I was on guard. One to the Melbourne Monastery and one toward the uh, Utbeck camp. I think they were messengers. I didn't think anything of it since they weren't coming here. You there. Did you see anything strange around Grandridge before the attack? I didn't. I was in the longhouse drinking with Birna and her men all night. She can really put it away. Thor himself could not drink me. Did you find enough clues around Grampridgeshire? Are you ready to choose the traitor? Garlin puts his visions above everything, to the point of fanaticism. Visions are like clouds. Each person sees a different meaning in the shape. And Galen sees an important meaning. Found Galen's longboat painted hastily with yellow paint on the day of the attack. Why would he mark his longboat differently from the rest of ours? A local said they saw someone running from the outskirts of the city to the river, just before the attack. Did they recognize the person? No, they couldn't be seen through the fog. But whoever it was, they knew something bad was coming. Leif told me he was working in his shipyard the night of the attack. The shipyard is exposed, and far from the tunnel entrance. Not the ideal man to lead Saxons into the city. I found an empty barrel of yellow paint beside a longboat launch. Yellow paint was used to mark a boat the night of the attack. An odd time for a fresh coat of paint. But that's his work, is it not? Birna is in love with you. Unanswered love is a volcanic emotion. Birna has always been unpredictable. But she's a warrior grown. She does not let her emotions guide her actions. Birna was drinking in the longhouse when the attack began. Others can attest to that. Hardly the behavior of someone expecting an attack. Birna was packed for a long journey the night of the attack. You think she wanted to leave us? I think she was prepared to leave, that's certain. That's all the evidence I think we need. You've been thorough. Who is the traitor? Garlin betrayed you. Are you certain? This will be the hardest thing I have ever done. Stay close by me, Eivor. I will need you. How do you plan to deal with this? As a leader must. My family, my inner circle. Today we make sure what has happened to us will never happen again. 
We end Wigman's life. But not all together, for you cannot survive the winter with a rat in your larder. Galen, you have betrayed me, Galen. I haven't! Soma, you're the key to my life. You must lead me to my destiny, carry me to the summit of victory. Do not warp what is real with the stories you tell yourself. I have seen no signs of your destiny. What I have seen is my people <sighs> slaughtered, my city befouled, and your delusions fueling the destruction. How dare you think your destiny, your greatness, outweighed all of ours! <gasps> <gasps> He believed too much in fate, and not enough in us. Take him away. I feel as if I have torn off my own arm. Wigman deserves death, but killing him won't make your family whole again. You think I don't know? This is for those who follow. To join me is to take an oath. To break it is to suffer. We make camp on the outskirts of the Isle of Ely. Join us there. She carries the weight of leadership on one shoulder, and the bonds of her people on the other. Now that she's lost one, she walks lopsided. It will take years of toil to rebuild those bonds with her people. Yet she is unburdened now. Lighter. She is a leader, not a friend, Eivor. Her mistake was thinking she could be both. is lost in hell by now. They will have the lost souls of the dead to answer to. Soma. Eivor, you're still with me through all this. Do not think I'll forget. We all need someone in dark times. Now let's collect Wickman's head. Good. At the first sign of trouble, my crew will jump in. Lightning tingles my blood, Eivor. I hear the voices of my slaughtered people on the air, calling Wigman's name. It doesn't leave this monastery alive. If they see me, this will get messy. Watch my lead.
Nequesape malale complexiones, agnus de, conteriat in sit, et multi benedicient. God, what is it now? Gone to ground in the bushes. Sit way be razed, Dracais. What's going on? Briars might hide you. Can't do this alone.
beginning, but... me from your minds. Fight in my name. Die for me. Die for me. That is no way to go for sacrifices. Their lives for yours. Is that how it works? Their lives meant nothing. No land, no riches, no titles. But my name will live on. The reputation of a good man never dies. But your name will soon be a curse. So be it. The riches I had in life gave me power. To curse me from beyond the grave gives me still more. Though I die, my order lives on elsewhere, everywhere. Yield to us. Give us what we are owed. The trade, the riches, the legacy, all of it. Yield! 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 If your hell is real, I'm glad you'll get to see it. That will take longer to repair. But we have a new friend and ally for me in my class, so The end of the storm is well in sight. You're right. I know you're right. It's just... It's difficult to see that end when you're still in the storm's eye. Eivor, you've been a guiding light. Calling out Galen like that, exposing his treachery, made me sick with a quiet terror. Betrayal like that is already a kind of death. Galen killed himself. Of course. And now I feel somewhat lifted. The weight is almost gone. Even if my heart needs mending. Ah, while I have you, Eivor, I'm reminded. I have this for you. Keep it knowing you have my highest respect, regard, and trust. My army is yours, should you need it. Soma Yalskona, my deepest thanks. And there's something else. As we prepared our assault, Birna had a word with me. We came to a sort of understanding. It may be best if she tells you herself. Until next time, Eivor of the Raven Clan. I hope we will see you in Grandbridge soon. Eivor! Birna, you struck quite a victory today. Don't undercut your own ferocity, Drengir. It was your blade leading the charge. You are indeed something to behold. We all fought hard. And now Grand Bridge is yours. You have your home once again. Ah, soon merchants and priests and reeves will run loose in its streets. All of its muddy charms will dwindle. Besides, with no room for me in Soma's heart, my home burned away in a quiet little house fire. Her priority is Grand Bridge and the people in it. That is noble, and beyond what I will ever understand. 
So I've decided I'm of better use elsewhere. With you. In your crew. You want to live with the Raven Clan? And sail and raid with you. If you'll have me. Look at this. Who wouldn't? I'll be happy to have you, Drenga. A relief to these ears. I've already packed my bags. Seems the wind calls me back to Ranty. Let's tell her the good news.